Hey, what's up? It's Alex and welcome back to my channel. Today, I am going to be unboxing my new coach bag as well as some new gym shoes I bought, the New Balance 9060. So while you're here, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Let's get into this content. It's Wednesday. Is it Wednesday? It's Tuesday. It's Hey Siri. Okay, Google. What's today? Wednesday, August 7th, 2024. It's Wednesday. It's Wednesday. What's up, y'all? It's Wednesday. And your girl got some packages in the mail. So let's see what they're talking about. Now, this first, I know what the packages are, so it's not like they're a surprise or anything. But how y'all doing? How are y'all doing? I'm doing good. I'm working, but I'm taking me a little break. Okay, I've been working all day. And I have a meeting in 30 minutes, so... Let me do this in 30 minutes. No, but I ordered me a few packages and you see who this one's from. <laughs> Yo, girl got a bag. Yo, girl got a bag. Not to mention, I already asked my husband for a coach bag for my birthday. Well, that is rapidly approaching, okay? My birthday is rapidly approaching September the 5th. Okay, Virgos, all day, our time. The season. The Virgo season. The virtuous woman season. It's almost upon us. And I cannot wait. I love my birthday. I love birthdays, period. My birthday, your birthday, whoever birthday want to celebrate, let me know and I'll be there. My birthday is coming up. I already asked my husband for a coach bag. I asked him for, I give him options, right? So what if he don't like the bag I like? I mean, it's not for him to like, but you want the person to be excited about the gift that they're giving you as well. So I ain't seen him like three options. I seen him one bag and then I seen him another bag with a chain and a trinket to go on the side. So like, I want to be excited. Which bag did he get? Did he get this bag? Did he get that bag? I don't want to know what you got me until I open it. I want to be surprised too, okay? I said a lot of nothing right there, but I got me a bag. So let's open her up and do some first takes. Oh, thank you for your business. I bet. A lot of fluff, a lot of fluff. You already know what this is. You already know what this is. So go ahead. Now, story behind this bag. So I'm online, I'm at, I'm online on coach. I'm looking through the bags. I'm like, okay, whatever. This bag is cute. Do I really want it? I'm not sure. The bag was sold out. So in my despair, I'm like, oh God, I'm looking online. I'm trying to find a bag somewhere else. I do not be trusting to buy bags off like Poshmark or stuff like that. So I don't do that. Um, if I'm gonna do it, I'm gonna buy from somewhere reputable like Rebag and all those type sites. But I didn't feel like this was worth doing all that. So I just chalked it up like, guess I'm never gonna get the bag. But by the grace of God, one day I was just trolling coaches. One day last week, obviously. I was trolling coaches, um, site again. And it was in stock. Now, this is the trail. The trail. Does it have anything? What is the bag called? What is the bag called? The Trailblazer 12? The Trail something 12? I'll put it up on the screen. I'll correct, get the right name and correct myself. But oh, look how tiny and cute she is. What the hell am I going to put in this little thing? And then sometimes I get skeptical about buying white purses. First of all, I already have every color purse in somebody's brand that you can think of, but it never hurts to have more than one option. Okay, obviously, if it's Coach, I've seen A. Wilkie, which Honey be selling the hell out of them Coach bags. So I hope they got her on the payroll in some form of fashion because I saw this and I was like, girl, I got to have it. But the reason why I got to have it is because... I thought it was so cute. It comes with this chain. The fact that you can, and let me scoot this back a little bit. The fact that I saw her on her channel take this bag and this chain and put it through her belt loops and rock this purse like. 
I don't know how she did it. I'm going to have to look again because it's looking a little loose. But how cute is that? How cute is it? How cute is it going to be for me to put on some all black and just trolley around Atlanta and going on my damn errands with this little cute little... Stop. Stop it. This is definitely my little errand bag. Okay, it's so cute. I've never had a purse this small. I've never had a purse this small. I'm going to go in my closet and get the smallest purse I can find to compare it. Yes, see, I need something like this. I almost got it in black. What can I fit in here, honey? My keys, definitely not a wallet. A card, a lip balm. It's so small. But I don't have any small bags like this, so I felt like this would be a cute, affordable try. You know what I mean? Like, if I'm going to try something this small, I'm not going to try no little tiny Gucci bag. You know what I mean? Like, look how little it is. It's cute. Let me get the smallest bag that I have and compare it. One second. Okay, these are the smallest bags that I have. Let me start with this one. This is just a little handbag. Same height, just about half the size. No, it's a little bit over half. It's a little bit over half the size. This is Zara. Throwback Zara. This is also Zara. This is just a tiny little bag. But the thing about this bag is it has two flaps. So I can put my bigger things in the back and my smaller things in the front. So this is officially the tiniest bag that I own. But I like it. It's not, I always say, dang, should I buy a white purse? It's about to be fall. Cause I do the whole no white after Labor Day, even though it's not a thing anymore. But winter white, it's not a thing anymore. You just wear what you want now. There are no rules in this game anymore. <laughs> but it's cute. I love it. Cute little, oh. Definitely can't take, in, take my camera with me when I'm trying to film, honey. Cause my camera won't fit. Here's a candle. Let me compare it to a candle. Now, this is Bath & Body Works. This is the one wick size candle. So, it's about as tall as a one wick candle. And as you can see, it's about as wide as a one wick candle. <laughs> so, loving this little bag. Oops, let me put my candle back where I got it from because these days, Two kids in this house, I put things back where they came from immediately. So I don't have to clean a shitload of stuff up later. But I love this bag. It sits in the palm of your hand, like so. And it's cute. I'm gonna have to go back and look to see how she wrapped it around her waist. She did it. I don't know how she did it, but I'm gonna go look and figure it out. But be prepared to see me in this. Okay, as I run my errands, okay? <laughs> Ooh, look, 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 look. Y'all, it's sold out again. All they have now is this pink and white one, which I don't think that's cute. That is not cute. Look, this is what I searched. So black is sold out. They don't even have white as an option anymore. It was $275, same price as the black. It wasn't the $375 like the pink one, which who the hell gonna pay $325? Right, let me stop. $325 for this, this not cute to me. It might be cute to somebody else. It's silver and pink is what they're calling it. But unavailable, sign up when it's back in stock. I signed up, they did not notify me. It was just on the website and I just happened to come across it. Thank God I did because now white is all gone. White is all gone. Damn, damn! So you can't get it now, sorry. I'll still put the link just in case you want pink and silver if that's your jam. Not mine, but it could be yours. Okay, we're all different. But I'm going to tuck this purse away in the closet. When my husband come home and be like, oh, what was in the boxes? What boxes? How, how can I tell him that I bought a purse and I didn't ask him to buy me a purse next month? But you already bought a purse. He don't need to know. He don't need to know. Your man don't need to know all your business. And when I say all your business, that's 
what you bought when you bought it and how much. Damn sure don't need to know how much it costs. Definitely don't need to know how much it costs. I don't care if it ain't expensive. He still don't need to know. He just gonna see me pop out of with it one day. And he gonna think it's something that I done already had. So, stay out of... He, my husband don't be in women's business. And I'm not gonna put him in it, okay? Next on my list also has a story behind it. So, y'all, I have been wanting these shoes. And why my son been like, ooh... Are these not yours boo boo they're mine okay so these are the oh did i tell y'all the name of that, that coach purse the trail crossbody 12. um short story about these shoes new balances i've been wanting some new workout shoes but the new balances the 9060s are 150 and i'm like do i really want to pay 150 for some workout shoes like that just doesn't really make sense and i would wear them outside of work but i'm really on my drawer ones and those don't even well sometimes they do cost 150 but most of the time they don't but lucky for me i'm a resourceful gal i signed up for their emails because i'm like i'm gonna get them i just don't know when but i don't want, for, want to forget that i want them so let me just sign up for their email list they had a sale they emailed me well, the sale wasn't on the 90-60s, except for in the kid's size. So, me wearing sneakers and knowing my size, I got a boy's, little boy's size five, which is the size that I wear in women's, which is a six and a half. So, not only were these on sale, signing up as a first time, um, you know, or using my first time buyer coupon that I got when I... Signed up for those emails. 20% off. I ended up paying like 80 bucks for these. Like, yes, 80 bucks. Like, I can do 80. I can do 80. My husband has these shoes in a grown man size. And they cute. They look good. See, these don't even look as bulky as I thought that they did. Like I said, 90-60. Kids size 5. AKA women six and a half, baby. You got to know your transitional sizes, okay? Because these shoes still online for 150 for women with no sale. And I got Rakuten. And I got Rakuten. So I think I got like five or six percent back. The shoes was free at this point, y'all. I, I told my I did tell my husband about these, so I don't have to hide these in the closet. I did tell him about these, and I told him about the great deal I got. I was like, baby, I did this and this. And then I ended up paying 80. He was like, look at you, babe. Look at me. Look at me. So these would be my new workout shoes. I hated my old workout shoes. I'm not going to say hate because obviously I have those shoes. Why would I have shoes that I hate? They're just like older before I start. I had, let me show y'all. These was my old workout shoes. I don't even know. I think these are some Air Max. They cool and all. Yeah, they are some Air Max. But they don't compare to this. I thought I had threw these away. I went in the closet, baby. They was not there. I was like, damn, did I throw them shoes away? Because I knew these had already came. But no, I just left them in the bathroom from when I went to work out yesterday. But I will be wearing these for the first time tomorrow when I go to the gym, okay? I'm sure I'll find something else to wear them with because... The color, like this is just a, a whatever color. Like you can wear it with anything. You can wear it with any color. And I like it. It looks like they're going to really support my um arch. And uh, I'm happy. So yeah. Air Max and Coach Bag, welcome home. Thanks for watching. I hope you like the bag. I hope you like the shoes because I sure do. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe. Turn on that notification bell so you can know the next time that I post. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day. I'll see you soon. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. I'll see you next time.